the show tonight. Who here talking? birthday and like, I'm weird about birthdays because I just am like we all have one like literally so it's like it always feels a bit weird to make a big deal out of it but it could be that every day kind of feels like a birthday to me like every day is a party like every day is a surprise every day is full of gifts I know I'm getting really like Oprah's book club on you guys right now but but it's I don't know, our life is kind of, it's sort of like we always say when we have friends that get married, like, the production that goes into it, it's like, really intense, but like, we kind of, like, that production goes into every day, we have to drive here and set the show up, and there's just a million moving pieces in what we do, and so every day is sort of this, like, glorious me day, it's like crazy, <laughs> but we share it with so many people, we share it with our band, we share it with our amazing crew, we share it with all of you, it's this one, it literally is like a party every day. Anyway, the point of telling you this is that we just had our birthday and someone pointed out it's our third birthday during this cycle of our record. Like we literally have been working this record for so long, it feels like. But each time we head out on the road, it just gets better and better, and the songs feel better, and our audience is great, and everybody's just so happy. And uh, and then you celebrate another birthday, and it's just like, holy crap! Like it's just it just keeps going, and I really feel like we owe a big thank you to everybody who just keeps supporting us. There's so many people here tonight who have seen so many shows. It's like you guys keep coming to my birthday. It's crazy. Uh, but I want to say thank you. I, I'd always dedicate. Oh yeah, 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 that's a great idea. Thank you, John. Sorry. It scared me a little bit, but it's fine. I was like, it's an ambulance! Oh. No, but thank you so much. I always dedicate this one, uh, you know, to fans, and I want you guys all to know that we really appreciate you. We don't take you for granted, and, and, and I hope that uh, we continue to see you at our birthday um, every single year, or maybe 20 to 30 times a year, so. <laughs> It's crazy. <laughs> Tegan, God. It's just the side ones. You know, I don't tell you when you put your pack right here sometimes it looks like you have a hump. Like, I don't, I don't tell you. Are you kidding me? There's so many things. No one else can see it, so I don't know. Besides, besides me and Dylan, Dylan, you can see what it looks like. Besides me and Dylan, I can't, we are the only ones who think that you have a hump on your butt. <laughs> People don't I miss really, them so people, much. People. <laughs> <laughs> Every day is my party. I've lost all my teeth. Oh my god. Oh, Guys, don't party. Everybody, don't teeth worry. They're there. <laughs> oh, it, it wouldn't matter if we were sisters. We spend so much time together. We torture everyone. There are people in our band and crew who probably wish we pray to God every night we die. <laughs> like, if those bitches... Not like real death, okay? Obviously, obviously I say these things because I'm actually afraid to die, so I don't, I mean, I assume that none of these people really wish for us to die physically. What did I say? I said Sarah was gonna end up <laughs> telling someone it's so hard to look at. <laughs> You've brought up death twice. I want to dedicate this also to my cat Taz, who died and I dropped about him last night. <laughs> Everybody's like, you don't talk enough anymore. This is what happens, that's why we don't. <laughs> 